Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. <clears throat> Fished this pond a few times before in the past and have yet to land a fish in here. It's pretty clear water, a lot of grass, a couple lay downs here. Had some strikes on the frog and plastic worms. But now, I got my kayak. I'm gonna fish weight with Senkos and fish the frog and hopefully get on a decent bite out here. You guys, hope you guys enjoyed today's episode and stay tuned. Oh, that was a fish, guys. It's a good sign. Took my worm. Oh, yeah, good sign. Good sign, good sign. All right, guys, let's get on the water. All right, guys, made it in. As you can see, the water is crystal, crystal clear. It's gonna. This is plastic worm. Wait, let's sink See if we can't catch some fish out here, guys. There we go, guys. Looks like a decent fish. Yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah. Do my worm, but I got the fish, though, guys. Barely hit it. Just gonna wait on this puppy here. Three seven two guys. Three pounds, 3.72 pounds. There we go. Check them out, guys. Nice, healthy bass. Almost four pounds here. Second bite of the morning, afternoon, rather. Let's get a release on this guy. Price little guy. Wait, this Senko it was, guys. And the color I'm throwing. This is the watermelon black and red. Get rigged back up and get back in here and check if we can catch another one, guys. Hey guys, first fish of the day. Almost a four pounder. I'm gonna wait for Senko. I figured fishing this place before and past the day for you. There's grass somewhere. What better way to fish grass than use a weightless worm? I'll take off this bank here and see if I can't catch another one. It barely hit it, but it, he, he was pinned pretty good. Got him in the top of the mouth. There we go, 
guys. Little guy. Maybe. Oh no. <laughs> I missed him. Oh. behind me guys and he ate it oh my goodness oh my goodness I'm talking about clutch oh my goodness I cast it behind me guys I saw him cast behind me and he ate that single look at that look at that guys Guys, got him on hook. Got a little bit of a cataract on that right side. We're gonna get a weight on this puppy here. Three forty-eight. Three and a half, guys. Three and a half. Let this guy go. Shallow, shallow water. I saw him cruising behind me and I casted that sinker right behind me and just kind of flipped it out there and there he was. He hit it instantly. That's the advantage of having a kayak, guys. You can just sneak up on fish and not even know you're there. Given the fact he was blind in one eye, but. Nice fish. Nice, nice fish, guys. Fish guys. Oh. They want this Senko guys. Jeez, wee, I just missed that. I blew it. I blew it. Dang it, I blew it. Alright guys. Calling it quits. Caught a couple fish. Two decent sized large mouth. One at three seven, I believe. One other three four. I can't believe. I can't remember what the exact number was, but they're both close to four pounds. And that's pretty good for first time catching fish to this pond. The only time I fished this pond was on foot. And uh had four bites today. One from the bank right here. One over there, one shallow, another one there in a shallow spot. But I just want to go over guys with you real quick what I was using, my setup and everything. So what I have here is a <clears throat> Shimano Caius 6 3 to 1 gear ratio, 17 pound mono. I like to use a mono quite a bit. And I have on here a uh, <clears throat> Bass, Pro Shops, Bass Pro Shop Spiral Graphite, 7 foot medium heavy. And as far as the lures I was using, trusty old Senko. I'm going to go ahead and give you the color again. I, I believe I said something about what color it was earlier, but I want to do that again for you guys. Excuse the mess. But what I was using was Mustad's Ultra Lock Light Soft Plastic Ultra Point. And this is a three odd four pack. Just got these last night from Walmart. I think it was $2.79 a pack. I wanted to try these guys out, and I actually like these a little bit more than. The standard Gamagatsu's offset. And I was throwing the 5 inch Yum, not Yum, 
Yamamoto Senko, watermelon, black and red. So guys, get your hands on some of these. If you haven't fished Senkos before, you should definitely do so. I had a blast out here. It's kind of hot. I had a, a late start, but caught some fish nonetheless. So guys, as always, like, comment, and subscribe. Share my videos. I'll catch you guys on the next episode of East Coast Bass Fishing.